Hey guys, how's it going? Welcome back to Tabletop Robotics. I'm Justin. This is episode 3 of Free CAD Tips and Tricks. Today's topic, STL files and how to import and edit them. Okay, let's get started. So in FreeCAD, the first thing we're going to do is open the STL file and we're going to open it up as a mesh. So we're going to go into mesh design. Then we're going to import a mesh from the file and we're just going to find our file here. Open downloads for me. Um, here I'm just going to upload the screw from my design. So here we have the screw as a mesh. So first thing we want to do is make sure this mesh is a solid so we can converted to a uh, object so we're going to go in we'll, so first we're going to click on the screw then go up here into meshes then do analyze then check solid mesh and if it said it and if it says it's a solid we're all good now if it doesn't say it's a solid don't worry i'll show you how to fix that a little later on in this video so then after that we're going to go into part design sorry not part design part we're going to click on screw we want to uh, create shape from mesh. Just going to click that. Now I'm just going to put 0 0.1 for the tolerance. You could change it. Just know that if you change it, it might take a little longer to process. So I'm just going to keep it at 0 0.1. Press OK. Wait for that to load. Oh, so here we go. Now after it's done loading, we want to try to get rid of some of these triangles as the faces. So we're going to click on the screw that we made but before we do that we're going to hide the original screw and we just press space to uh, to uh, toggle the visibility so we're going back onto screw that we just made go back into part and we're going to go into refine shape and this should get rid of the some of these smaller triangles on top on the flatter surfaces so we're just going to wait for that load still loading and there we go now as you can see, this refined shape doesn't get rid of all the triangles. If you have complicated shapes like this, uh, this kind of helix here, you want to keep all the triangles are going to stay there. Can't really get rid of them in an easy way. So after that, this is still a shell of an object, so we have to convert it into a solid. How we do that is click on the object one more time, go back and put, and we'll go into convert to solid. We're going to press that. Wait until it loads again, and there we go. It made a, a solid out of the screws. So here we have the object fully solid. Now you can now you can edit this object as much as you want. And so like any other solid object, we can edit this. So we could, like any other object, put it like a square, then cut the two objects from each other. Let's do that now real quick. Oops. There we go. Uh, then just do a cut. Wait until it loads. Still loading. And there we go. We got a cut there. Or if you want to do like a pull on one of these faces, you can go into draft. Then click on any face you want to extrude or push in. Then just go into this trim or extend tool. Let me just. We can trim or extend that. Um, try that one more time. Click. Like that. There we go. So really, the, anything you can do with a normal object, you can do with the objects you just created with the STL file. If you really wanted to, you could click on one of these, make a sketch on top, then extrude or cut from this object. That's another way to edit it. So next, I'm going to show you how to fix a broken STL file. So we uploaded the STL file again. As you can see, this file is not fully a solid, and you can check that by clicking on the file going to analyze check for solid and you can see it says it's not a solid so now we have to fix that in order to convert it into a uh, an object for FreeCAD so what we have to do is fix these triangles or replace them essentially so we're just going to start on bottom here this little hole so what you're going to do is select the STL file go into meshes uh, close holes you're going to click on it 
and what this does it makes triangles here now these triangles sometimes might be facing inwards so what we have to do is click on the SDL file go back into meshes then harmonize normals and that will flip the triangles out now you can see it actually didn't fill this hole it just made one more triangle so we're just going to manually add the triangle in so we're going to do add triangle we're going to select all three points add triangle the normals facing out so we're going to have to fix that so harmonize normals so here we have the triangle the hole fixed so I'm just going to fix this big hole here and I'll show you my end result okay, so here I finished the fixing of the file so as you can see if I go back into analyze check solid it now says it's a solid and you can continue with the other steps I showed you before in the beginning of the video okay guys so that's how you can import STL files into your free CAD model and how to edit and fix them if you'd like to give it a thumbs up consider subscribing check out the other videos on this channel uh, check out my Instagram I post some fun things there sometimes I'll see you next time bye